Are you worried about losing your precious vision to a rapidly progressing eye condition? Imagine waking up one day and suddenly realizing that your vision has changed dramatically. I'm Dr. John Legaretta, an ophthalmologist specializing in retinal diseases, and today we'll dive into the world of wet age-related macular degeneration, or wet AMD. Get ready to learn about the causes, symptoms, and cutting-edge treatment options that can help save your vision. Trust me, you don't want to miss this crucial information, so stick around and let's get started. Wet AMD is a condition that affects the macula, a small area in the center of the retina responsible for sharp central vision. It's called wet because it involves the growth of abnormal blood vessels under the retina, which can leak fluid and blood, causing damage to the macula and leading to vision loss. So what causes wet AMD? The exact cause is not fully understood, but several factors contribute to its development, including aging, genetics, and environmental factors such as smoking and poor diet. Wet AMD usually develops in people who already have dry AMD, which is characterized by the presence of drusen or yellow deposits under the retina. In wet AMD, abnormal blood vessels grow under the retina driven by a protein called vascular endothelial growth factor, or VEGF. These blood vessels are fragile and prone to leaking fluid and blood. As a result, the macula swells and becomes damaged, leading to vision loss in the center of the visual field. What are the symptoms of wet AMD? Unlike dry AMD, which often progresses slowly, wet AMD can cause rapid vision loss. The main symptoms include blurry or distorted vision, a dark or empty area appearing in the center of your vision, straight lines appearing wavy or curved. If you experience any of these symptoms, it's essential to see an eye care professional immediately as early intervention can help. To diagnose wet AMD, your eye doctor will perform a comprehensive eye exam, which may include dilated eye exam, visual acuity test, AMSR grid test, optical coherence tomography, fluorescein angiography. These tests can help your eye doctor determine the presence of and severity of wet AMD and guide the appropriate treatment plan. Now let's discuss the available treatment options for wet AMD. While there's no cure, several treatments can help slow down the progression of the disease and preserve your vision. Anti-VEGF injections. These medications, such as Avastin, Lucentis, and Ilea, are injected directly into the eye to block the action of VEGF, reducing the growth of the abnormal blood vessels and leakage. Injections are typically administered every 48 weeks, depending on the medication and the individual response. Photodynamic therapy. This treatment involves the injection of a light-sensitive drug into the bloodstream, which is then activated by shining a low-energy laser onto the retina. This process causes the abnormal blood vessels to close, reducing leakage and slowing the progression of wet AMD. PDT may be used in combination with anti-VEGF injections for some patients. Laser photocoagulation. This less common treatment option involves using a high energy laser to destroy the abnormal blood vessels. However, laser photocoagulation can also damage the surrounding healthy tissue and may not be suitable for all patients. It's important to work closely with your eye care professional to determine the best treatment plan for your individual case. Regular monitoring and prompt treatment adjustments are crucial in managing wet AMD and preserving your vision. While you cannot entirely prevent wet AMD, you can take steps to reduce your risk and slow its progression. Regular eye exams, early detection and intervention are crucial in managing wet AMD, so make sure to have regular eye exams, especially if you're over the age of 50 or have a family history of macular degeneration. Healthy lifestyle. A healthy lifestyle can lower your risk of developing wet AMD or slow its progression. This includes not smoking, maintaining a healthy weight, exercising regularly, and eating a diet rich in fruit, vegetables, and omega-3 fatty acids. Nutritional supplements. In some cases, your eye doctor may recommend specific nutritional supplements based on the A-RED study findings to help slow the progression of the disease. Wet AMD is a serious condition and can lead to significant vision loss if left untreated. That's why it's essential to be proactive about your eye health and visit your eye care professional regularly, especially if you have risk factors for macular degeneration. I hope this video has provided you with valuable information about wet age-related macular degeneration. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and subscribe to my channel for more information on videos on eye health. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Stay healthy and take care of your eyes.